What's up guys, Purple Lotus of something out here. So we're gonna check out this place called Voodoo Donuts. Featured on diners, drive-ins and dives. I think it was also featured on Man vs. Food. It's a uh, world uh, renowned, at least nationally renowned in the US. Um, they make all kinds of concoctions, bubblegum donuts, um, all kinds of different names, uh, fruit donuts, filling donuts, and shapes and sizes with all kinds of things you can put on them. So it's a cold day, and we're gonna check out Voodoo Donuts. You can already see people with those infamous pink boxes. It's right down this way. People with those infamous pink boxes. We drove by a few times and we noticed that uh, the line was very long. So we needed to get some parking. And here we are. Voodoo Donuts. We also have a budget of $10. So we're basically getting one thing per person because it can get quite expensive when you look at the menu on the website to have about 50 or 60 different items. So we're going to narrow it down to one item per person. So there it is here across the street. And actually, there is several different locations throughout the city. Oh, that's a big, huge building. Wow. Oh, some food trucks. What do they have here? Sausage tire. Well, let's check out some of these food trucks. Sausage Thai. Well, not. I said sausage. Sausage Thai food. Wow, look at these, some euros. Awesome. Halal. Wow. Oh, Iraqi burger. That one looks awesome. Lamb sub. Wow, what is this one here? Oh, bubble tea cart. Always awesome. Lots of pink boxes. Look, lots of pink boxes. You can go and check it out. You can see right here. Very, very, very long line. Very long line. So we're gonna go wait in this very long line and decide what we're gonna get. And look at the menu while we're waiting in line. This should be awesome. There's like 20 people in front of us here waiting in this long line. It's uh, moving pretty quick though. Some of the items we get here. The maple blazer blunt. The old dirty bastard. The Marshall Mathers. Butterfingering. Let's see, Voodoo Bubble. Okay, Voodoo Doll. Yeah, that's the one that's uh, on YouTube. The, uh, so we're getting right by the door here now. See the amount of traffic in this building. Yeah. It's a lot of people. Probably about 30 people. So now we're inside, as you can see. So we come into our decision, the old dirty bastard. The dirt and a voodoo doll. It's coming from our items that we're gonna get here. Check it out. Super busy. Like the line is literally out the door, as you saw. A little bit of uh, some displays here. Yeah. You can get all kinds of uh, 
stuff here too. Buy the merch. Oh, behind us, I'm gonna go up. It's our turn. You can see it's super duper busy. Keep saying that. They get one voodoo doll, uh, dirt, and an uh, old dirty bastard. And I'll ask these back. Yeah. So we got our pink box from Voodoo Donuts. And uh, we're gonna try them here. We're just waiting for the other person. What did we get? So we got the Voodoo doll, the dirt, and the old dirty bastard here. So the next step would be obviously to try them. So we're gonna go get a seat here. So we just got out looking for a place to eat. Obviously you can see there's no more seats. So we're just gonna stand up and eat it. So we could probably just do this here. Let's do this. Okay, so we're gonna try them. The voodoo doll. Probably the most infamous one. Old dirty bastard. Wu-Tang. The dirt. Let me just try this one here. Oh, really crunchy, really good. The donut itself is pretty good. Obviously, there's a lot going on on top here. So it's really, really sweet. Let's try this one here. Oreos. The dirt. This one's actually super good. Really sweet, also. The voodoo doll. You can bite it. Okay. If you want to bite it. Oh, okay. There's jelly inside of it. It's filled. Maybe raspberry. It's all pretty good. I mean, it's a lot of hype, a lot of choices. All right, so one more look at Voodoo Donuts here in Portland. Lines out the door. We just tried our donuts and it's ridiculously good. We got three of most of the specials that are on the menu and we paid about $8.75. So it was pretty good. It's worth the hype. The line moves pretty quickly so you don't have to be in line for a long time, so to speak. It's, it is a long line, but it moves really quickly, as you can see, so. Several different locations. This one is on uh, 3rd Street, I think it is. Uh, there's two of them, I think, in Portland. So it's a super awesome place, good donuts, like 50 or 60 different tries, good service, quick, efficient, and fresh, and it's awesome. So coming from a cold Portland, Voodoo Donuts, Purple Otis Samsara, 